now we are going to discuss another problem in regular falsi method to find the root of the equation x e power x minus 2 is equal to 0 okay first we need to find the interval of a comma b in which the root lies between by trial and error method we need to find a comma b by substituting first we need to substitute uh, 0 in that function so f of 0 is equal to 0 into e power x minus 2 it is equal to minus 2 and now we need to substitute f of 1 f of 1 is equal to 1 into e power x in place of x we need to put 1 1 minus 2 it is equal to 0 0.7183 okay these two are adjacent positive and negative values now the interval will become 0 comma 1 Okay, the root will lies between in between the zero and one. Okay, now we need to calculate initial approximation by using the formula x naught is equal to a into f of b minus b into f of a by f of b minus f of a. We need to substitute this zero and one in place of a and b. And we need to proceed further. X naught is equal to 0 into f of 1 minus 1 into f of 0 by f of 1 minus f of 0. Here we already calculated f of 0 and f of 1. And we need to substitute this minus 2 and 0 0.718 here. And it is equal to x naught is equal to 0 0.73. Okay, now we need to substitute this 0 0.7358 in the given function and f of x naught is equal to f of 0 0.7358 is equal to minus 0 0.4643. Here the value we got is minus and a will be changed because if the value of the function is negative, a will be changed and the value of the function is positive b will be changed and now a will become a is equal to 0 0.7358 and b is equal to 1 b does not change now we need to calculate x1 which is the second approximation x1 is equal to by using the same formula what we are used for x0 here also the same x0 is equal to 0 0.7358 into f of 1 minus 1 into f of 0 0.7358 by f of 1 minus f of 0 0.7358. We need to calculate here f of 0 0.7358 and substitute here. And now the x1 value is equal to x1 is equal to 0 0.8395 and we need to substitute this 0 0.8395 in the above function f of 0 0.8395 is equal to 0 minus 0 0.0564 okay now here also we got minus and now here also a will be changed a is equal to 0 0.8395 and b is equal to 1 now we need to calculate x2. x2 is equal to 0 0.8395 into f of 1 minus 1 into f of 0 0.8395 by f of 1 minus f of 0 0.8395. It is equal to x2 is equal to 0 0.8512 and f of 0 0.8512 it is equal to minus 0 0.006. Here also we got negative value. Now a will be changed. A is equal to 0 0.8512 and b is equal to 1. Now we need to calculate x3 x3 is equal to 0 0.8512 into f of 1 
minus 1 into f of 0 0.8512 by f of 1 minus f of 0 0.8512. It is equal to x3 is equal to 0 0.8524. And f of 0 0.8524 is equal to minus 0 0.009. Here also we got negative value. Now here a will become a is equal to 0 0.8524 and b is equal to 1. Now again we need to calculate x4 x4 is equal to 0 0.8524 into f of 1 minus 1 into f of 0 0.8524 by f of 1 minus f of 0 0.8524. Now x4 will become x4 is equal to 0 0.8526. Okay. Previously, we got x3 as x3 is equal to 0 0.8524. In the question, they are asked for three decimals. Here, 0 0.852 and here 0 0.852 up to three decimals. These two are equal. So, we do not proceed further because they are asked for three decimals and the root will become root of the equation is equal to 0 0.8524. I provided the notes in the description. Please go through it. Thank you.